continuing the discussion of my new version 2.0 of the complete microfiber package, uh, the next towel, which is another brand new towel in the lineup, uh, this is a, a uh, what I call my door jam towel, uh, but this is a 350 GSM edgeless towel. When I say edgeless, there's not a silk or a satin edge that's sewn in. Uh, so this is a ultrasonic cut, uh, relatively, I mean, these should be pretty lint free. These towels have been around a long time. Uh, this is a, a deviation from the very famous Eagle edgeless towel that I just never, uh, forgive me to the rag company, my good friends in out of Boise, Idaho, I've just never been a real heavy, heavy plush towel kind of guy. Uh, actually, let me rephrase that. I used to, I thought I was. I bought all those big, thick, heavy plush towels, uh, but I find them to just push stuff around. Um, I like the lower nap, like the 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 420 GSM lower nap, a um, little heavier weight, but more dense uh, towel. Uh, they tend, they tend to, they for me, they tend to work better. They push less water and and, and liquid around and tend to grab it. So this is a, a deviation from the traditional towel that you see a lot of detailers use. This is a 350 GSM version. Uh, so I'm, again, I'm using this for door jams, for the jam area around the, around the trunk, also under hood uh, is what I use this towel for. It's extremely soft. It's 350 GSM, so it, it, this is the lightest feeling towel out of all of them behind me here. Uh, you could use this for anything. As with all the towels that I'm using here, um, these all could be used for multiple purposes. Right? They can be used for anything. Um, this one is probably the most versatile. You can use it for polish removal. You can use it for detail spray, or waterless wash, rinseless wash. Uh, you probably wouldn't use it on the windows. You could use it in the interior if you wanted to. Uh, uh, but I like this for jams, right? It, one of the, the philosophy here on this soft towel for me is the jams usually there's dirt left over, right? So there's water in the door jams. I come around and I don't want to scratch it. I usually correct and protect my jams, but the dirt is there. So it's very different than uh, like you're washing the paint, you bring your Incredipad XL uh, and you come and you wash it off and you, so you're pre-rinsing it, you're foaming it, you're washing it, you're rinsing it again. Your door jams generally don't get that much treatment, at least mine don't. Uh, and so I want a really soft plush towel that I can go, I can fold in quarters, come and grab the bulk of the dirt with no pressure, and then come back and dry it and you know flip the towel over and finish the drying process. I use a Kinotech Showroom Shine on the door jams uh, and uh, it tends to work really well as a drying aid there uh, for, for those areas. Uh, so I use this towel for that purpose. And so that's the general the philosophy behind it. This is a 70-30, 70% polyester, 30% polyamide, the more absorbent material. Uh, I believe this, I'm pretty sure this is a Korean made towel. towel. Uh, but I'm really psyched that they came out with a lighter weight version of this. So uh, it, now it has a place in my cabinet uh, at 350 GSMs instead of 500. Uh, so this is the, uh, the Obsessed Garage, we'll call this the door jam, uh, the trunk area, the, the underhood area towel uh, that we use generally with uh, something like Kinetech Showroom Shine, CarPro ECH2O. I'm going to have a new drying aid coming out here soon from PNS. Uh, so this, uh, this is a great towel. I think you'll find other uses for it, but uh, I have uh, 20 of these in the cabinet. I'd suggest you get some. pulls you back, your foot naturally comes off the gas. You have to keep your foot to the floor or the floor.